everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back for another Fake Grand Order video, and I'm joined with my brother, Nux. Hello! And we are here to finish the story, the final fight in the Tam Lin Cup versus Morgan. Uh, the way we do these is, as I said multiple times in the video, but just to make sure, just in case you decide to only watch this one, it is a draft-style video, so I'll pick one, then my brother picks one, then he goes here, and I'll be using my brother's support. Whatever he wants to be used as a support, that's what's going to be end up using as a support. Um, we have a single shot at getting this done. We don't look at a guide. We do read to see what, um, the, the hint, hint the hint is to see if we can get a good idea of how to do it, but that does not stop it from us completely losing because we're obviously experimenting and seeing how it will work out. It will sometimes lead to cases where we accidentally create a great team that can actually function and do it well. And then there'll be other times where it's just a complete massacre from start to sound <laughs> to end. So we'll see how the final one to this. We're going to try our best on this one. Um, or at least I am. We're going to all do it. Are you ready, boy? I'm ready. Let's go in. Let's so, see what this is. Read before we choose one of your units. So Morgan will summon a lot of servants. The summoned servants will buff up Morgan. The summon servants will retreat at the end of the turn. However, if you manage to defeat them before they retreat, you will gain powerful buffs. If Morgan possesses special defense that are time limited, uh, Morgan possesses special defenses that are time limited. If you manage to defeat the summon servants before they retreat, you can reduce the number of special defenses from Morgan. Okay. So where's your person located? They're going to be in all okay. level ninety. Level 90. Yeah. And we're going to confirm the support setup. Of course. There we got are. next. We got Morgan. I have the brought program. in the bloodline. This is the bloodline? This is the bloodline. Sadly, it did not use the correct ascension for, say, but here we got Tamlin Gawain. We got Tristan. We got Malusain. Do, do, do we? <laughs> we got Habitrot. We got a Toria caster. Mm, I feel like there's something slightly off with. Some this of is the new bloodline. This is the new blood. This is the solo Sokoa of the Morgan's Fairy Knights. Is that what you're saying? Yes, yeah, so we got we got uh, Brittle Mart right there, and uh, we got uh, the the clone Morgan that she can summon, and then we got Merlin. Uh, you're even using Merlin's fucking... You couldn't even use hers. You had to use <laughs> Merlin's bond essence. So it uh, looks like I have Habitrot with the damage C. Oh god, I didn't even see that. Alright. <laughs> we'll be bringing in Habitrot uh, here up at the front. This is Bloodline uh, 2.0, Habitrot. Alright, so we're going to edit all this out. You know what I'm thinking? I'm going to go start here. Who's gonna? Who's Habitrot's I Love You Solo? I think there's only one person that can be that, and that is, of course... Another? Another. That's right, the Bond 2 Tam Lin. I love you solo, as she looks directly at it. Brittle Mark. Exactly, and she'll be our other power here. With 200... That's right, boom. And now we need our Tomatonga. Who's our Tomatonga on Who's this one? Who's our Tomatonga? We need someone who will support us from the... The sidelines doing his yeah, 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 yeah. Someone give him the yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we should go for. I'm thinking waiver. I'm thinking waiver. All right, so we'll go to caster. He seems like a guy who would hype someone up, and you know what? Some people would say he's one of the biggest hype men <laughs> that exists. I would say that for sure. All right, let's go. Or maybe see. he's our like, maybe he's our top guy. He's like Paul Heyman. Before he got outed by the... Before he got, like, beat to a pulp and lost his phone number. Fair. Lose my number, Roman. Lose my number. If you, if you really think about it, he got his ass beat so bad, he changed his number. He's like, I don't want to be It's probably because Solo calls him every night. <laughs> when you coming back to support Solo? <laughs> Imagine getting a call from Jacob Fatu and he just says, I would, love, I would like to talk about your opportunities in the new bloodline. Uh, excuse me a second. I love you, Solo! Alright. We need... Um, so Morgan is going to summon a different servant no matter what. We don't know what type they're going to be. Yeah, we don't. But we she, we know she's a berserker. Yes, we do know that. Maybe the answer is really... It's time to bring her back, huh? Three mm. for three on this challenge. Re... Spree. Yeah, at this point, yeah. <laughs> you know what? If we're going all out, we're going all out with the new bloodline. Yeah, with the new bloodline. She is our, um... Uh... 
multiple tsunamis in a row. That's who she is. <laughs> okay, so she's like, she's not part of the bloodline, but she, she she's is. Being, she's being called up, and he's like, you know what? It looks perfect when you put him together. When you put Bronson Reed next to him, you're like, man, this fits perfectly. He Do could one. be a Samoan. He could be a Samoan. You don't need to always get Samoan. Some dudes just look big and brown. All right, let's see. Next. Um, see, we got Tama Tonga. We need Tonga Loa now. Tonga Loa. Is that just MASH? It might be MASH. Seems a little bit mean to call MASH. Okay. Then I'll... Do we need Roman at the end? Just just because? Oh, that's actually good. A Roman, a Roman type... Would that just be Morgan then? Yes. I think we bring Morgan to our own fight. Damn. And then we have her. We, we unfortunately can't give her a very good CE. We can't give her the damage CE. Oh, we can. But it's equipped on who? It's equipped uh, on uh, Fatu right now. We can go here. That's that makes what, a little bit more sense. That's what, that's what I'm thinking. All right, then we need to get this mesh one off here. Yeah, mesh doesn't really need. Mesh to see. doesn't get Tonga Tonga Lua doesn't get to have. No, they lost the belts. <laughs> <laughs> he lost the belts. So there we go. Uh, let's see, we can have a... We're gonna go here, then we may as well just give him a... Um, one that lets him... Noble Fan has him right from the start. We'll see. They'll never see it coming. Alright, here we are, the new bloodline. New bloodline. Powerful. Let's go. Uh, I love you, Brito. I, lo <laughs> I love you, Brito! <laughs> let's go. Best Tom Lin. Best Tom Lin. Ever drop. Well, I can't wait two years to get your buff to make you on par with Bradamonte. <laughs> exactly. It's Bradamonte and uh Bradamart fight for the <laughs> fight for third place. <laughs> fight for third place. <laughs> Here she is, defeating Morgan. Did you enjoy the athletic zone? Have a word. Oh, that's not that's a function. That's very scary. Only here for a single turn, huh? Okay, let's see. Well, we, we can, can probably kill Kishin. We can't. We probably can. And uh, go here. We can't touch Scothahawk at all. No, almost not at all. Okay, so each turn. Debuff immunity, increase grit strength. That sounds pretty good to me. Do we need this right now? I don't think so. Not yet. Because that increases MP gain. Actually, we would like some MP gain now that I think about it. We are going to probably... Okay. We'll go here. Go here. Let's see. This, does this give a burst? It, somewhat, because it's only a level Okay, four. so that, that will be the last one here. So I would probably want to... Play poison. Three times over two turns. And then MP gain. This is one of these... Decreased defense. Okay, yeah. So I can use... We don't need to use the middle skill. We just need to use the first and third. And we won't need the... Uh... The other. Yeah. Actually, we might. So you know what? Fuck it. I'll just no. go There we go. Yo. I'm you. <laughs> I just thought it was funny that she goes, Yo! Yo. Okay. So, we're Hogan. gonna try and go for Hogan. And we're gonna go here. Hogan! Hogan! We're coming for you. Coming for you! Alright. I guess two busters, because they're gonna crit anyway. And That's then Liz is gonna do big damage anyway. Yeah. Uh, Brit unfortunately does not have a damage bonus for this event. <laughs> yeah, but at the same time, I feel like. So her damage it might be a little bit overstated on here. It will, but like it'll be enough. Okay, yes, yeah, so with the crit, it was enough. Thank yeah. you very well. Kick. Oh, so close. She's so far away. Ow. 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 Whole team's got invincibility. Those oversaw. Two who oversaw gimmicks. Oh, she's me. bringing everyone. Yeah, she's bringing all of them. This is the Scooby Doo Monsters Unleashed. This is it. This is it. Let's see what the buffs they give, by the way. I feel like well, it's different. That? Retreat at the end of the turn. When HP reaches zero, negate the defense disadvantage due to class affinity for a single enemy. When she reaches zero, decrease Borgen's organization authority. Count down to eight turn, eight times. And then this is when HP reaches zero, decrease Morgan's end. When HP reaches zero, increase quick card effectiveness to a single enemy. That's not as good. So I think we can go here. 
hit the noble fan hands some... with Liz. Yeah. I feel like that's good. Yeah. There you go, Thalda. Okay. And then she'll probably... Do we do all Buster here now? Or do you want to go for... Breaking? Just to confirm it that it will go there? I feel like we would probably go... Um, with that, just because we would want more arts to do more noble phantasms. Like, That's we're not fair. gonna be able to kill Skahawk at all. That's fair. If, Scotty? No. Yeah, the, yeah, Scotty, you're right. We're not gonna be able to do that. So she's gonna come in here and at least try and kill. I move my debuffs as well. Kick! Yeah, it'd be, it'd be nice to have a noble phantasm up for the next person. I mean, we'll see. That was still a lot of damage, but I don't know. If it, it would have to be double crit on this one. Not crit. Crit there. Yeah, it's alright. We... we maybe could have killed her, but I also don't think that an increased a quick card was great for this team. For to be Liz. Hurt. Yeah, no, not 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 really. Fish. Let's see the medical team. Samson and I go. Hold on. Okay. We oh. don't want her to have that Buster buff, huh? Which one right here? Increase Buster card effectiveness. I think there's no way for us to stop this Buster card effectiveness. I, th I thought it was when they die, they took it away from them. Um, or is it just yeah, her defense thing? It gives it to us. Okay. So let's see. Can we maybe switch out? Morgan. We could bring in Morgan, but she doesn't have enough to do a Noble Phantasm. No. She would get 50% from there. Unless we give her the 100% to do it. Yeah, that's true. And then we can do that, and then we can hit Guts, and then go from there. And that will work out. I think that works out. This will be the one place where we get to use it. Yeah. Uh, okay, we're bringing in Roman. Which one? Let me see. Do we want to do we wanna switch out Waver or Britomart, actually? No, that Britomart. All right. I feel like we need his skills to clock count down. That's fair. Alright, I'll use that. Just because Morgan isn't attacking us yet. And when Morgan starts attacking us, that's when the issues <laughs> come. <laughs> yeah, I forgot the other reason I would have wanted to bring him in was because he had the uh, the most of it, but it's fine. Because we can still do uh, one of these chains. Yeah. No! The act of clemency. That should hopefully be enough. Uh, we Almost. No, Mango is definitely gone. She is. Butter up to Morgan. That's good. Oh! <laughs> it's pretty good. Oh. Ow. Is she dead? Pretty close. Is she dead? No. Roman v. Roman. I didn't even realize that it would probably be a good idea to save on the guts until after I used it. I forgot yeah. that they don't stack. They do not. No. Okay, so I'll go here. Well, then I can go here. And do what Roman was supposed to do, which was... Uh, stand back. <laughs> stand back and let Solo cook. I think it'd probably be better to go here and then go here, here. Yeah. Yeah. Up! I love Liz. The way she makes the funny noises. I like Cinderella Liz. Cinderella Liz is the best one of them. Of them. She is... Even uh, the funniest one of them is obviously the the the, the Chinese one. The one that isn't Liz. <laughs> the one that is technically Liz, but not really Liz because she's pretender. But is actually 100% just Liz. Um, yeah. All right. Ow! <laughs> yeah, that that that, that the big hurt. There she goes. There goes Roman. There goes Roman. And that should be it now, right? No. Zufu, the old man has come back for you. He is my my op. Okay, stir up versus divine. Six turns, forty-eight left. Yeah, we're slowly getting rid of them. Okay, cool. So let me see. Can any of them kill this? No, like no, absolutely not. Zhongju, maybe. So we can go here, and then protect for the single turn, and then just build up. It's a build up turn. Yeah. We might be able to kill Zhongju. Yeah, you're right. Maybe if we if all things go correct. 
Nice, thank you, 200%. So that goes down another one. Alright, cool. Oh, their little thing is. And that's just uh, safe for the turn. She does it again. This is Babbage and T. How many more of these? Five turns? 40 left. Okay. Uh, but she doesn't really increase her Noble Phantasm ever. No, she. I think she starts after the little are all gone. Okay. I think we go here. I think maybe Waver? Waver. And, and then, then go for the arts? Liz and... I mean, no matter what, they're going to be targeting her for the foreseeable future, so... Yeah. Actually, we probably don't have to then. Then, in case we can go yeah. here and see if we can try and kill with a brave chain. Yeah. All right, we'll try. Yeah. God, really, a crit on that one? That's insane. The crit was needed. It was needed. <laughs> Thank you very much. And then Teach is gonna do Teach thing. Mm -mm. No. Oh, it did a crit, lot because it was a crit. Yeah. Teach, get out of here. Okay, this, there are two more? How many are there? I think she says it's never, it's it's infinite, isn't it? No, I don't think so. I'm pretty sure it is. I think she said that it never goes away. It just well, keeps... we can't do damage to her until they're gone, until we get rid of the thing by killing them. It's true. It's Phantom, um, you know I'm what? I'm gonna go here. Does a, does a wave crit kill? <laughs> if... On Phantom? Yeah. No, because he doesn't have the doesn't have enough. Oh, yeah. But we can. So we can technically kill them both. We can tech. We can 100% kill both because we can Liz, and then if he survives that, then Buster with her, and then the Buster kills him 100%. Yeah, I think that makes sense. Um, we don't really need this. Okay, we'll go here and then here. Let's see. All right. It should hopefully be enough. It is a disadvantage here, but it is single target, MP5, 200% extra damage. Oh, barely. Oh, thank you! Thank you, Zolo! Thank you, Zolo! Waver is, <laughs> is our, uh, Jacob. Yes. Please live, please live. Don't crit, don't crit. Oh, Yang! One more, one more. Yes, Yang! <laughs> Yang, so good! It was luckily a crit at the end. Here comes the Merlins. Alright, so now she has... Three more 16, turns. 16. Three turns. Um... Oh, wait, I can... Funny enough, do this. Get rid of it. So, um, Yang is dead. But which one do we want to kill? We can potentially... Um... Use waivers and then maybe get a stun off. And try and see if we can kill maybe Lady Avalon. We can't stun Morgan. Can she not be stunned? No, she has debuff immunity now. Immune to mental effects. Oh. So maybe. I don't know if the counts as a mental effect if we want to be real with you. But, well, um, let's try. Yeah, I'll go here, here, and then. I'll focus on Lady Avalon. I probably could have been able to kill Merlin now that I think about it. Yeah, because it's the caster. Yeah. Okay, I was on the other stun. two. That's good. Let's see. Let's see how much this does. Unfortunately, not very much because she's not burned. No. It would have done decent to Morgan if it was possible. Okay. Yeah, it's not bad. So that hopefully kills? Yeah. Nice. Oh. Yeah, and there goes Yang. We knew this would come, but... Thankfully, Merlin gets the two attacks, and she doesn't. Yeah, and he was stunned for both of those. Thank the reporters, too. Here comes the reporters. Oh, God. Oh, God! <laughs> oh, fuck me. Are you kidding me? Of course, Doman had to come out and ruin everything. Unfortunately, we do not have enough to do anything. Besides live. And Waver, aka our Jacob, is dead. 
Uh, we have to save him, so we have to go here. Oh, we're getting, we're, go getting here. we're getting rid of Tomatonga. <laughs> Tomatonga has no C. He has nothing. Okay. But I'm gonna go here. Go here and see maybe if that's enough to maybe kill Delman. No. No, it was not enough. But she should live. Okay, here comes Mad Mad. But we're also gonna get like 50,000 different curses. Dang. I forget, does he pierce did he, invincibility? Did he, no. Who did he kill? He killed Waver. Yeah, he did. Instant death. Oh, it was instant death that got him? God yeah. damn it. I forgot Doman had that. Anyway, Morgan has her NP. Don't worry, we got it. Let's begin the final trial. How many did we be able to take off? One she turn has left, eight. but she has eight more, so I don't think we're living. Except maybe Liz. Liz lives this, but the aftermath afterwards. Do we build up more NP? I guess that's just the way to go. Okay. Because we're not going to be able to do anything, so we just go there. Pew, pew, pew. Kick. Kick, kick. I told you there's gonna be an end to it eventually. Yeah. Okay, this is gonna do a lot. And then we are maybe dead. She probably has an additional attack and kills. Oh, that's right. Burnamach still has invincibility up. Oh, we still have the invincibility up from long ago. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. When we got her, we put her away. She had invincibility. Okay, so we live for now. Yes, and she has that gone. So Liz can now actually do her stuff. Well, let's try it. And then, I guess, from the- I guess just build up stuff for the next turn. Even though there is not going to be a next turn, that's what I'm building towards. Debuffs. Super attack. Kick. Here go. Super early dragon kick. Oh! Unfortunately, not enough damage. She has too much buffs on her, unfortunately. She does. And we have buffs on us, but just not on the same level. No, and the fact she keeps them. This is the super duper boss, so I yeah. don't expect you much. Did she, did she still have invincibility? What the hell? She did. It's three hits for three turns. She doesn't have a lot of these, though. Okay. So we'll go, I guess, build towards uh, another NP. I don't think we can get it. I don't think we will get it, but, you know, just in case if we can, may as well try. Keep on kicking her. Yeah. Unfortunately, her MP gain is not the greatest. No, it's because that skill is enough. Yeah. This, this is, is it. This is the end. This is the end, but at least we made it to the end. We did make it to the end, but we did survive to the end. It's true. The new bloodline tried its best, but unfortunately what we needed was the rock. Unfortunately, we forgot the rock. <laughs> if we had put the rock instead of Roman, maybe we would have had a chance. Who would be the rock? Of Fagin the Alter? <laughs> would probably be. Who's the most shows up like every once in a while? Okay. Yeah, but he doesn't have the power of, of the rock. No, he doesn't have the same power of the rock. It would be um Gilgamesh. Yes, yes. There was one other person I was gonna say, but I'll save it for later just to avoid some spoiler stuff. That's the end of it all, everyone. I feel like we could have probably done that. If we were, um, if we had a, if if Liz had an AOE uh, NP of some kind, with maybe NP game. And maybe if I didn't do, like, a little joke at the end. No, I think she was still doing pretty good, though. She I, was. She lived the entire fight. She did. Uh, because uh, once she got all those buffs in, she was doing pretty good. But the problem was, we should have been able to get more of those buffs what to be able to get What up at the end was Doman. Yeah, the Doman really did hurt, because he fucking death procced on Waver. And once you lose your Jacob... Yeah. Solo can't can't do anything without Jago. Exactly. Solo's For now. Cut. Maybe he's gonna get his get stronger one day. One day. Cut to the I can't show WWE footage, but if I would if I could show footage, it would be the footage of him getting beaten and holding up the one of acknowledgement. <laughs> That's it. I acknowledge our tribal chief, um uh writer Liz. Writer Liz. I acknowledge him and I say I love you, uh solo. To her. I love you solo. I love you solo. And we love you solo to everyone else out there. Best of luck on finishing up your lotto grinds. Hopefully yours was did better than ours did. We actually did pretty good for this one, actually. This is the best we've done. This is the best we've done because we got one more win. 
We did because we snuck in there because I was fucking angry that this guy would have been able to beat us because we were so close to it. It felt like a 50 50. He said end. no second strike. We say otherwise. Well, technically, we, we beat him on the meta level because he said no second strike, and I said, you know what? Second strike. And he wasn't ready for it. <laughs> yeah. He wasn't ready for he the second strike. He's like, I don't have a second strike ready. I don't believe in it. You don't believe in it, but that's, we do. That's right. We do. And that's the end of the video, everyone. Say goodbye, boy. Goodbye. Go watch Red One. Go Red One now in theaters. Two hundred fifty million dollars. <laughs> Two hundred fifty million dollars. Imagine this. Imagine this. If I could put the video of the Rock talking about, you could probably <laughs> put that up. You could probably put up the entirety of it. Says it says on the side. Watch. Subscribe to Wokey. Yeah. <laughs> you could put uh, over our conversation. You could put up the little like. He should be fading in like a ghost. Like the news thing that said it. You know, actually, what should be happening is that he's slowly building up, and then eventually we hear at the end that's when he overpowers us and talks about Oppenheimer sitting in that seat. Yeah, so that's, that's what I'm thinking. That's, that's what I'm you thinking. You can try and do it. That's what's sad. happening. I watched that's Oppenheimer. It was Peace. amazing. Goodbye. But I was thinking, holy shit, this thing, red one on this screen, uh, with this technology. It's going to be game over.